Hi everyone, Tiffany from StuffParentsNeed.com and today I want to show you some things that I found on the jewelry site BobbleBar.com that's B-A-U-B-L-E-B-A-R.com it's not a subscription service, it's just a really fun um, jewelry site. I would call it uh, maybe mid-range jewelry, it's costume jewelry but um, it's kind of more of a middle tier price price range. So for me personally, this would be a site that I would go to one to two times a year to upgrade um, some of my just everyday jewelry pieces. If you work outside the home, it might be something that you want to visit a little bit more often. Uh, so I want to show you what a box looks like from Bobble Bar. Uh, here's the inside, very cute. I have already opened it and in fact, <laughs> I've been meaning to do this video for like a week and a half now and I keep having this set aside and, and ready to go and then I keep rummaging through the box to um, grab jewelry that I want to wear so that's a good sign that the things that I've picked up um, are beautiful and that I want to wear them okay so you get a list of the things that you bought and how much they cost right there up top you also get a uh, return slip for anything you don't want, although I'm noticing it says postage due unit, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure if this means you have to pay the postage or if they have to pay the postage. I'll research that and follow up with it in the blog post I write about this. Okay, everything comes in a black little sack like this. My opinion, I would rather do without these and spend a little bit less money, but. That's just my opinion because I ordered, I don't know, five or six pieces, so I have all these bags. What am I going to do with them? But at the same time, I mean, they're nice and they're pretty. Everything comes packaged and wrapped more so than what you're going to see when I'm pulling it out. I've already unwrapped everything because I've worn most things and also because um, it'll just be easier to show you. Okay, this is one of the necklaces I got, and it's um, a little crooked right now, but it's a three-tiered necklace. It's really, really pretty. I've worn it a few times. It's kind of a way to do that layered look without, um, those are my children in the background. And let's see how much this costs. This was $34. Okay. Then you will, um, oh, you also see in every piece the little, their guide to bobble care, which tells you the do's and don'ts, like, I don't like um, keep it away from water and things like that. My child is not liking the video like that we have set up for her. Sorry, you guys. Okay, second piece. I don't like this one. This was kind of a set. Um, oh, I don't of, like this was fun. You got to pick any three jewelry, any three little bracelets from a, set of options that they had for stacking and the price to buy the set of three was $25. Like I said, I had several options uh, that I got to choose from and these are the ones I chose. I thought this one was kind of cute and sporty even though I'm not sporty at all. This one is my favorite, favorite though. I love purple, I love a little bit of shine and I love the way that you pull it and it um, tightens. I just adore this bracelet. It's very pretty. Okay, next. Okay, this was another set of bracelets that I think previously they were selling these as individuals, but they sort of had a special going. Uh, the set was $48 for all three. They're very, they're heavy, um, so they feel really nice. They have some nice clasping features. This is what this one does. This one though, this one is too small for my wrist. It can fit but it is really uncomfortable. So, unfortunately for me, my set of three bracelets is really only a set of two. Um, I like the other two though, and I've worn them a lot already, so I don't wanna send it back. When you get a set like that, it's all or nothing. So if I wanted to send it back, I'd have to send all of them back. The next thing I bought is, I thought this necklace was just really, really, um, really cool. You'd have to wear a particular kind of neckline with it like something that goes in a little bit more but um I just thought it was really really neat uh, this it's called a collar necklace and it was $36 uh, two more pieces oh this set was really fun uh, just some little costume jewelry they call it the neutral neutral foliage studs and they were $38 for the pair um, 
I knew what I was getting when I bought them. But when I opened them, I still felt a little disappointed um, because they're just so, they're so similar to each other. With that said, this, more than anything else in this whole box, these are the things that I have pulled out again and again and again. Um, I'm pretty indifferent as to which, which earring set I'm wearing at any given time, but I've worn them both a lot. I think it would have been cooler if one of these sets had had some different colors in it, just to give you more variation. I don't need, or at least I didn't think I needed, two sets that look so similar. But again, like I've said, I've worn the heck out of them. Um, okay, this is my last item, and this was my splurge in this set. Did I tell you how much those were? Those were 38. Uh, these are amethyst sea glass drops, and they are gorgeous. Um, there'll be a picture of them on my blog in case you can't see the detail in them really, really well. These were um, $62, which is quite a bit more than I would normally spend on a pair of earrings. Um, but I will tell you, they're absolutely striking. Um, I'm really, really glad that I went for them. Uh, purple is one of my favorite colors to wear. It's actually my favorite color in general. So I know I'm going to wear them a lot. Um, and after having seen them, I think they were worth it. That's just my opinion. Uh, the other thing was that this was unexpected. There was like a fun little sample. I haven't even opened it. That came in um, the box. And it is... It's something from Pantene. Am I right? Yes. Pantene. Oh, a dry shampoo. I love dry shampoo. Unexpected. This is my first box from Bubble Bar. I don't know if you get a fun freebie every time or just when they have something. It was fun. It's not a reason to get jewelry, but it was a fun little perk all the same. So that's my experience with Bobble Bar. Again, a little pricier maybe than what I would normally spend, but some really, really beautiful pieces. I'll have uh, close-up pictures of everything for you on the blog. Thanks.